Hello everyone, Epic Clips here, and today I'm bringing you guys another first impression of the new cars, and this is the car called the Musume. So this car is a, another longer car, kind of like the Dominus, but it is a little bit more sloped than the Dominus and a little bit taller. Kind of another mix between the Dominus and the Octane. The hitbox I very much like. Um, it's a little bit longer, a little bit taller. It's a very big hitbox, a very tanky kind, kind of car. So, you know, this car seems great, doesn't it? Actually, let me start searching for a match here. You know, it seems something that, you know, would be totally great to play with. Uh, but it does have one major downside that I don't think I'll be able to get past. Because, well, if it didn't have that, I'd be using this car right now. Because this happens to be my favorite body type so far. Let's just show you what this downside is. Let's see if you can figure it out. Do you see that? It's incredible. So, even if we're going... You know this way it's just so very 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 slow on the flip the one thing I don't like about this car oh we may not get a teammate here if we don't get him in I'll skip to the um, to the game all right well we got into a game uh, against the same opponents actually but different teammate maybe that would be a good thing okay so this car just very good, besides from the slow flips. Okay, well, that was not good. But, has to be my favorite, like, hitbox flying and everything besides flips car. But it is not, I don't, this car is not, when I said before I do a uh, car face up against my two favorite cars, this is actually not my other favorite car. Just because of the whole flip situation. Even though if you're boosting and stuff, it flips perfectly fine. Just the, the standalone flip is terrible. So that leaves you at a really big disadvantage. You know, if you don't have any boost. Oh, shit. Wow. You know, if you don't have any boost or something and trying to get back. It leaves you basically naked to get back and you won't be able to get back in time. So it's a big thing with dropping. Why you not live? What is that supposed to mean? I don't know. Well, I don't understand why my teammate didn't go for that at all. He just kind of like left it. I'm going to try to grab boost here. Again, like all the cars, this car sounds pretty cool. They added some cool sound to all these new cars and I like it brings a whole different um like fun aspect to the car to the game that guy's got the pigeon the pigeon hat yeah the pigeon hat i want it but that's the one i think that's the one new chopper i don't have the other thing i want is these the wheels that i have right now but in pink i don't know how exactly i think it's just random that you get um wheels unlocked i don't know if it goes like um, like the wheels that you have is, will be the wheels that you'll get painted because I hope it works like that. It gets pretty solid hits. You know, they're pretty hard. Nothing too much though. Not like for its low f flip speed you'd think it'd get a harder hit, but it doesn't. It's low flip speed is probably just because like the size of the car. That was really a bad decision of mine. I should just drop back, but you put that nice placement. Just shouldn't have flew so high either. Oh, he has no idea how I got the. This is not the Neo Tokyo car. I don't know. Maybe it, I've got no idea. It's the new. Um, I guess maybe he just means the new expansion car. Oh, why am I turtle? No, god damn it. Why do I have to land on my side so often? <laughs> I just did not land on the wall right. Well, this isn't going so good. trying to read what he wrote. I 
It's distracting me. Got no boost. Shit. Okay, well, he's going with it. Um, also, does not get up the quickest either. It's really not. You know, it has a great. Ooh, okay, nice shot. Um, you know what? Also, I like about this new update is once they did this new update. Um, well, I feel like I'm just repeating myself. It may just be because it's so late. But once they did this new update, um, the whole aspect of win streaks were really involved now. So, like, if you win a couple games in a row, you get to play harder op opponents. I can't speak at all. I'm having a really hard time, <laughs> which I really shouldn't be, but I think it just means it's a little bit too late. No. Nope. Yep, it's getting too late. Okay. I think this will be the last one of these that I'll record for today. And then I'll uh, I'll record my second favorite car tomorrow. Because, again, I, I just recorded these three videos together. I mean, they're all just three games. So I, I felt like I didn't really have to do more than one game like per thing because I'm going to have that one that has all four. So we'll have a nice little series about testing out these cars. Well, that was brilliant. Nope, it's not going to go well. Okay. Nope, okay. He hit me. Yeah, it's getting too late. It's getting way too late. And I've got work tomorrow. So much keen concentration in this game. Okay, did not. It just didn't. Okay, where's my teammate going though? Like, yes, I'm not playing great, but I make a mistake and he's like up my ass. Alright, and then he does not go for that. like this is where I think the problem comes uh, yep okay all right well let's see what their ranks were here okay so they were There were the one guy was a bit higher than my teammate, and then neither one of them really that good. But I'm just late and tired. So this car, um, well, let's give my little opinion on it. Very nice design. It looks very cool. I must say that. Flip speed, very slow, too slow to really bear and play. If it had a faster flip speed, just something like the Dominus, uh, I would play this a lot more. Uh, the turn speed in this car is also very slow. Power slide speed is very slow. Everything's basically very slow. Um, the body shape is great. I love the body shape. It has to be my favorite hitbox. And it does make a very, very cool noise. But besides from that, I really can't play the game play the game as well with this car because of its slow flip speed because it's such a major part of the game. But altogether... So far, like in the DLC, you know, this car is just something that you can, I guess, get used to and play with it, but I wouldn't really recommend it too much. I'd recommend one of the other cars if you were looking to switch to one of the new DLC cars. Uh, so, it's really been my first impression of this car. Uh, 
I'm thinking I'm going to try to put these all out in one day. So the next one should be the truck, which I do like. That's my second favorite car, the Marauder. But, uh, and then later on, we'll have all four cars in one video, one game with each car, and then the car face-offs to come. And also the VR will be, the Vive when it gets in, will be scattered through that. So, I hope you guys liked the video, and if you did so, leave a like and subscribe for more, and I will see you guys in the next one.